I would say the vast majority of high handicap players struggle with hitting slices. And sometimes I'll have a student hit a big slice that curves way off to the right, and I'll say, do you have any idea why that happened? And they'll say, uh, no. And I say, well, if the ball's going to the right, the club face is aimed to the right. So what do we need to do to get the club face square? First of all, we set up square with a very good neutral grip where the hands are not going to be needing to do any manipulation during the swing. Then, first checkpoint on the way back when shaft is parallel to the ground, I want the uh, club face parallel to my spine angle. If it gets back here, it's wide open and you're going to have to make some kind of compensation during the downswing. So from here, I take it to the top, I want the club face parallel to my left forearm. If I do that and don't do any manipulation in the downswing, the club face is going to end up square at impact and the ball is going to go straight and with a pretty good amount of power as well. So uh, always be careful about your club face. Club face angle throughout the swing. Make sure it's square. What is square, technically speaking? From here to here, the square club face is one that is perpendicular to the path of my club. Here to here. If it's here, it's open. If it's here, it's closed. Always want to have it perpendicular to the path. If you do that, you're going to hit a lot of good straight golf shots. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them below, and I'll answer them as quickly as I can.